Hello, myself, Dr. Soumya Basant, working as a cornea consultant in uh, Zamindar's Microsurgical Eye Centers for the past one and a half years. You have seen a lot of people, especially kids, rubbing their eyes. Do not neglect this symptom, especially school-going children where you see them constantly rubbing their eyes, you know, violently, vigorously. Please do not take any over-the-counter medication or OTC drugs because they can contain steroids more than ca causing any helpful effects, they can cause a lot of harmful effects on the eye if, because of all these drugs. Please do not take any of the over-the-counter medications. Please consult your ophthalmologist. Frequently, we see a lot of cases in the OPD, that is our outpatient. A lot of, you know, a small category of patients, especially children less than 18 years of age, starting from the pubertal age, roughly about 11 to 12 years, seen more so in the boys. This is called vernal keratoconjunctivitis. Because this frequent eye rubbing can cause a lot of harm on the eye. They can lead to some another condition called as secondary keratoconus. The treatment aspect of keratoconus is totally different. So please consult your ophthalmologist if you see anybody frequently rubbing their eyes. Vernal keratoconjunctivitis is a category of disease which is seen in younger children, especially more so in the boys compared to the girls from the pre-pubertal age, starting right from 6 years onwards and till 18 years. The symptoms are so distressing, please do not neglect it, okay? In older individuals, we see something called as atopic AKC or atopic keratoconjunctivitis. Do not neglect it even if seen in older individuals, always seek medical attention. Please do not see a general physician, please do visit an ophthalmologist for the proper treatment and continuation of your treatment. It's a very elaborate thing, the more the patient is exposed to the allergen, they will develop VKC or AKC, vernal keratoconjunctivitis or atopic keratoconjunctivitis. It's a prolonged treatment. Patients as well as their parents need to have a little patience because children, whatever said and done, you know, it's very difficult to inculcate a lot of things in them. Always do avoid eye rubbing. The commonest thing anybody can suggest is put ice, cold ice packs on the eye. If nothing is available, dip a clean handkerchief in cold water. If no cold water available, plain tap water will suffice and place it on the eye.